What do we do in social studies? After 16 years of teaching middle school students. We got to put on the gas. Put on the gas. Let's go. Dana Swartzel has learned a lot about kids this age. They begin to find themselves. They begin to grow and get uh, personalities. It's the type of change that if captured in a mural might look something like this. How do they feel? What are what are they um, experiencing these few years that they are here with us? And then where does that take them? It's been Swartzel's dream to add permanent artwork to a school known for its arts education. Walls that talk is that dream come true. It describes the journey of middle school students from the time they get here to the time they leave. See how she put the gray right here and then it goes, am I right? Yeah. And it goes into the blue. Yeah. This has been in my heart and in my creative spirit for at least two years now and to see it actually happening is wonderful. The sprout of acorn and the growing tree and then there's leaves. Sonny Malarkey, whose own son attended League, is the artist behind the mural. I love that the kids had so much to do with um, how the um, the idea came about, like this is their school and they're taking pride in it. Um, it's something that they get to see and watch develop and get onto the walls. League student Diana Allen says it's an unforgettable experience. Just seeing it like get darker and like right here, it's like starting to cover it up where that acorn right over there, um, it's still pretty transparent. So it's really nice seeing it come, come together like that. This is the first installation of what Swartzel says will be a three-year project. There are also plans to add a QR code that students can scan to learn even more about the project that has everyone talking. I get excited when I see the students walking up the stairs and commenting on it. They, they talk with the artists and say, this is really cool, or wow, I love that we're doing this, or even I see my idea up there. It's a daily reminder that middle school life may seem black and white in the beginning, but quickly transforms into something beautiful.